campuses, University Yes Academy in Detroit. For years, the charter school has been one of the city's best. But tonight, some of the students there are getting some very bad news. The high school is shutting down ahead of this school year. Jamie Edmonds talked to parents who feel they're getting left in the lurch. The sign outside University Yes Academy promotes its middle school. But what exactly is going on with the high school? Parents just got the news yesterday. It's closing its doors. 17-year-old Jakari Jenkins Petway shows off his school uniform from University Yes Academy. But just two weeks before the start of his senior year, he got some bad news. They said the high school is closed. They're, they, they're adding a kindergarten and another kindergarten and preschool, elementary classes. They're adding more of those, and then they took away our high school. The school called a special meeting last night to deliver the news. Obviously, it was a shock to parents and students alike. Due to a decision made by the board, who we don't know anything about, uh, they're going to discontinue the high school. Now Dad Amari Jenkins has to scramble to find a new high school for two of his kids. Same goes for the other 250 high school students and their families. Most of the high schools have already started the registration process. They've already got kids, kids registered from the year before. Classes are already filled up. Parents and students are up in arms. Some telling me over the phone they believe it was a financial decision made without regard for their kids. The head of the new management team, New Paradigm, brought on just last week, released this statement that reads in part, we are committed to working with all of the families and are available to support them in working to secure admission to our partner schools in the city. New Paradigm was just brought on to manage the school less than one month ago. We are experts at school turnarounds and we are focusing our energy on making sure all of these children receive the best education possible. As for Jakari, the search is now on I mean, for a new is, school mm -hmm. for his senior year. He's now getting a life lesson in dealing with adversity. In Detroit, Jamie Edmonds, mm -hmm. Local 4. The meeting last night was with just the senior class and their families. Right now there is a meeting with the rest of the high school to deliver the news. The Jenkins hoped maybe something could be done so the senior class could graduate this year, but that just won't be possible. The school is now strictly K-8. through